former Kitui governor Charity Njilu now says that President William Ruto cannot take Azimio leader Ayla Odinga to the African Union Commission job alone. While she commended the president for the move, Njilu said that the opposition also has many other people he works with. Njilu noted that had it been a woman, the former prime minister would not have gone to for the AU job alone. She joked that she still needs to understand how male relations work in leadership. The former governor asked President Ruto to support women leaders in mobilizing for resources to deliver on their visions for the people they represent. Let's just listen into what she has to say. If you have more women in leadership, they'll help you carry a lot of the work that you are doing. They help you, and very well indeed, you'll be freer than you are today. Women, I think there is something I want to say here about politics. Something is worrying me very much. We women have seen here that we are going to make sure that we will work across political divide. All parties, we as women must come together and ensure that whatever party you are in will support you where you are. What for me has shocked me in the last few days is a new handshake, Your Excellency. And they thank you for supporting Baba to become the AU chair. But you cannot take him alone. He has many other people with him. He had many, many people with him. And I still need to understand, and I'll study this a little bit, to understand how this works amongst male leadership. Women don't do that. Uh, since I haven't known how it works, I'll continue to learn 